Hey guys, how are you doing? And in this episode, we are going to see how to check iPhone battery cycle count after updating to iOS 16 and later version. Till iOS 15, we were able to check from analytics and improvements within settings and, you know, by browsing through the log aggregated files. But this has been changed since iOS 16 by Apple and I was not sure where to find it. And one of my audience, Manik Avail, suggested me in Twitter. So I must thank him at this moment where we can actually find the battery cycle count in iPhone. So if you're running iOS 16 and later version, you can use this method. And we have already published a couple of videos about how I maintain my battery health and I have suggested it. It is a working technique. You don't have to worry about the battery cycle count. You can try those tips to maintain your iPhone's battery health. Just two easy to follow tips. You don't have to worry about the cycle count or the battery health. But I leave a link, you know, the useful links that you can check out in the description and in the first comments related to battery health do check them so coming back to the topic in settings privacy and security analytics and improvements you can see that i have turned on these top three toggles normally i keep them off you know to prevent any battery consumption in the background or any analytics data being collected and sent to the app developers or to apple if you prefer to send any such crash logs or log files you can of course keep it on but i always keep them off just yesterday morning around i have turned it on to make sure that the latest log files are being generated to check the battery health sorry the battery cycle count being recorded in the log file so here you can see the analytics 2022 11.05 is available right now it is generated so from this latest file we can retrieve the battery cycle count multiple files must be there but don't worry about it just check the latest file and you will be able to find it with same dates and different numbers so in that file you can see that it is quite a long file and scroll down to the bottom and in the last you know about three lines you can see last underscore value underscore cycle cycle count which says 15. There are other data about the battery also recorded at the end of this file but those and all not important for us right now. So the battery cycle count itself is 15 which means like normally for an iPhone it comes up to 500 as per Apple suggestion but as per my understanding it comes up to 600 in latest iPhones you know to reach the battery health of 80 percentage. And till iOS 15 we have to copy this entire file and then we manually search the file by you know copying the text inside that log file and opening the notes app and pasting it there and you can find any content within this specific note if you, you are unable to find the battery cycle count as suggested or if it is not generated in the same way in your log file then use this method simply tap on the three dots and find my find in this note and type last underscore value underscore cycle count so this way you will get five data as you can see the search results shows five one of five so all these things will show the same exact value and the battery cycle count is right now at 15. This is my new iPhone 14 plus so I'm not surprised when I come back to the battery health and charging section you can see that the maximum capacity is 100% still. I follow the charging practice since iPhone 7 so don't worry about the cycle count. The reason I'm telling this again and again is because you know I get plenty of questions related to battery health. People worry about it so simply follow the suggested practice. I've been following it since iPhone 7 and it is working for me that's what i have suggested to my audience as well and many have found it working in the past few years also if you have any questions related to iphone and ipad don't forget to search our channel to find it faster i hope this video helped you to find the battery cycle count if you find it useful don't forget to share it with your friends and for more do subscribe thank you and have a wonderful day